Look, there's the professor. Oh my gosh, that was not a, who I was expecting when I heard the name Professor Magnolia. She looks like a scientist, but she's got like a Naruto headband a little bit. I don't know. So have you unraveled all the secrets of Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness no. The whole thing is still full of questions. I'd hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... But what? That is the question. Dear me, I'm sorry. I didn't even notice my guests. I'm gonna talk like this. Oh my god. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come on, let's head indoors. Oh my gosh. I love it. I have to keep coming up with accents on the fly. And oh, it's, it's hard. But it keeps you on your toes, right? Even though I'm sitting down, so I'm not even on my toes. Why hop, dear? I see Wulu has made some new friends. And you must be Loquatia. I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonya, and I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. You must already know about Dynamaxing, right, Loquatia? Professor Magnolia has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years, and it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamaxing to the fullest. Why does Dynamax sound like a, I don't know, like Viagra a little bit? Like, I'm gonna Dynamax my... never mind. There you go again, Leon, always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know, like how many different types of tea there are. Hey, Professor, do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee he should endorse us for the, po the gym challenge. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them, you silly little land lover? Hop in, Laquisha only just started out as Pokemon trainers. There's still loads they don't know yet. Dearie, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Galar region become strong trainers. Isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That goal is precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. Well, there you go. Endorse us. Right then, in that case, how about this? Let's see if you two can. Sh let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. Oh yeah, he just he just held out his hand and healed me all over. Right, I'll be waiting outside, Laquisha. Dude, I'm gonna kill you. I have so many Pokemon already. Jesus. Now remember, be sure to give it everything you've got. The best thing you can do for your Pokemon. And for yourself, too. Oh, yeah. Hey, look, you've got it. Oh, he's it. Oh, I thought he was angry for a second. I, was, I thought he was like, squee. Oh, my God. Who's this? Do what plants would you... Do what plants would want instead of what you want. If you keep that in mind, plants will grow. Well, all right, crazy old man. Let's go for a battle. Oh, let's go upstairs first. Let's rob them. Let's see what uh, we can do. Wow, she's got headphones. Who is this? A hairdryer and barrel hairbrush have been left lying around without being put away. Well, that's fantastic. There's everything you can need for the latest and trendy makeup looks. Is this, uh, what's her face's room? There are a number of sketches and photos pinned up. Yeah, I think this is supposed to be uh, probably Magnolia's room. That's crazy. All right, let's go. It's, uh, looks like it's, it's sunset time, so, uh, ooh, hey, you found a bottle of fresh water, even though it's been probably laying out here for quite a long time. If it took you this long to find it, it's probably been out here a millennia. And I found a great ball, even though it was, I never got that. If you find a Pokeball or something in the wild, or whatever, shouldn't it just be what it is like? Because that showed the icon of a Pokeball, but it was a great ball. So like, did the Great Ball have the Pokeball in it? Or, or what? I don't I don't get it. Hurry it up, Loquatia, stop thinking to yourself. You've got you've gotta battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. Dude, you're not getting endorsed. I'm gonna beat you so hard. Oh my god. Alright, are you ready? I'm gonna become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is, and to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee we've got what it takes. Oh yeah, sure. Okay, why not? I'm gonna beat you and get that endorsement. 
I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle too. Listen you two, the reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn it from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today. So show me something good in this battle. Oh yeah. It's time for my legend to begin. Except it's time for my legend to begin. Oh yeah. You're challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hop. Oh boy, Hop, you're dead. Hop, you got three Pokemon though, so I don't know what I don't know what you're gonna do. I wonder what level they are. Have you gotten a bit stronger? Me and my team will put you to the test and see. Oh no, no, you're level six, son. You're not you're not doing anything to me. Water gun, this boy. Yeah, look at that. You're basically dead already. Oh, you're gonna use tackle? Okay, yeah. All right. Oh, four. That's not bad. Um, I'm just gonna pound you right back, boy. So, I, yeah, I've heard a lot of bad reviews of this game. I don't know. It, it seems okay so far. People are like, oh, it's been rushed. And, like, it's not good. And when you battle inside, it's a white room, and they didn't do any detail to it. And there's only, like, half the Pokemon in the game. But, like, I understand that. Because, like, if you put all the Pokemon in the game, then they have to keep having new Pokemon every game. But if you put half the Pokemon in the game... They can come out with another, like, few games with this, and then have more Pokemon in it, I guess, but, like, also a lot of the old ones that weren't in the old games. So, like, I can kind of, I kind of get why they're doing it. Um, plus Pokemon, like, there's some Pokemon that's like, really, do you, do you really want that? Like, I don't know. Let's get Foxy Lady out here and just see what we can do with her. Um, cause, like, I like catching them all, but I like catching all the ones that are available in the game. Like... What I always try and do is I always try and get the Pokedex done. I don't really care too much about the National Dex. That's not my, uh... That is not my forte. Like, I'm not gonna go... Have a taste of our true power. Our flames are burning bright. No, they're not. Oh, you're gonna use Ember. Oh, don't Ember me. It's getting pretty lit in here. Oh, dude, I just beat you up. Jesus, this is like... This is such a brutal attack. I'm just gonna beat you up so many times. Oh, that was a crit. That was good, actually. Oh my god, is this seven? No, it's six hit times. Six hit times? Hit six times. There we go. Let's do it again. Why not? Oh, so good. Oh, so strong. Good thing I had an orange berry, which kind of looked like a... Either a really dried berry or, like, a nut. Oh yeah, beat up. Good thing this won't take a million years. <laughs> oh, jeez. Come on, come on, Foxy Lady, I believe you can do this. You can beat Score Bunny. Oh, critical hit. Heck yeah. You landed a critical hit on my Pokemon. You've got plenty of spirit, something or rather. Is that what they say? Do they just have like a little dialogue now in the middle? Where it's just like, oh, your Pokemon did something to me. That's crazy. Dude, Foxy Lady's beating the shit out of you, honestly. Like, I don't mean to swear. I don't really care, but like... You're, you're dying. You're dead. Oh, look at that. Two critical hits right there. Wow. Pokemon was hit four times. The opposing score bunny fainted. I'm so proud of you, Foxy Lady. You killed it. You you killed it. I mean, you probably didn't kill it. You made it faint. But, like, you basically killed it. Um, Water Pulse. Heck yeah. Growl. Bye-bye. I'm gonna learn... Or I'm gonna forget a, a basic function of being an animal. Which is learning to growl. I just forgot how to growl. Like, I still have that move in real life. Grrr. I'm growling. Okay, it's a Ruckety. Oh, you know who I'm switching to? Wait, does Bolt... Yes! Yes! Oh my gosh, this is gonna be great. Bolt, are you ready for this? Are you ready to shine, my little Corgi pal? Oh, he's so cute! Oh, I love him! It'll be a close one, but that's exactly my sword of match. It's not gonna be a close one, I'm sorry. I have, like... I have six Pokemon that are all stronger levels than you. I'm- you're not gonna win this. You're just, like, you it's just not. I'm sorry. Oh, you're gonna use Peck on me? Okay. Solid, solid. But, uh, I'm just gonna nuzzle up to you a little bit. Yeah. Alright. Well, look at you! Seems like you've really learned your type matchups. Oh, and he's paralyzed. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. This is, uh, it's just so, like, it must be so awkward for, uh, 
Leon and Magnolia in the background, just to see Leon's little brother get completely annihilated by basically a stranger. Like, oh my god, I feel bad for him. Like, he just got destroyed. Like, oh man, I don't know. Leon's probably looking at him just like, wow, is this really all my younger brother has? I mean, is this all my little brother has in him? He really sucks at the game of Pokemon. I don't know why I keep doing this voice, but it's really fun to... Oh man, you defeated Trainer Hop. Oof, gutted that I lost. More like big oof. But I'd expect nothing less from my rival. I got a bunch of money, and uh, yeah. And even and I even got my Pokeball throw perfect too. The sting of defeat and the joy of victory. I guess going through both is key to the two of us getting stronger, right? Yeah, pretty much. Oh yeah. The Quisha hop. Well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I've little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. Oh nice. You know what, actually, like, I don't know, I feel like he's just doing that. His brother is just like, his big brother just saw that match, Leon just saw that match, and he's like, well, I can't just give it to the girl and not give it to my younger brother, so I'll just give it to both, why not? Oh man, we got an endorsement! That means we can actually take the gym challenge, that's amazing. Yes, thanks Lee! I swear I'm gonna win my way through the gym challenge to reach you! You may both be still be young still and plenty rough around the edges, but it was a proper battle. Charizard, not, Charizard, Charizard, Charizard. Char <laughs> I just thought of like Chad. Like if I ever get a Charizard, I'm just gonna name him Chad. It's gonna piss a lot of people off. Char uh, Charizard and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell in our bodies. Our uh, oh god, what is it? The mitochondria could just feel everything. It has the powerhouse of that cell, you know. Hop, you've always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeball out. Things that have nothing to do with real strength. You're a wimp and I hate you. Honestly, I'd been worried about you still obsessing over that nonsense, but it seems like you've really grown a bit, little brother. And I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon out of, out of battles out of you too, Laquisha. Alright, Laquisha, you and me are gonna train up against one another to claim to, uh, to aim for that champion's title. Absolutely we are! We're gonna do it! The... oh god. My accent, not my accents, my voice is hurting. Oh, The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokémon will grow. Oh my god, I'm having a heart attack! I'm just kidding. Huh? What was that? Oh, what the heck? It's a shooting star! That just happened to land right by us! In... in no reason at all. Wow, what a coinky dink. Wow, you took both of them, Hop? You douche. Loquatia, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. Since there are two of them, you should take one yourself. Nice. A wishing star. A stone found in the Galar region with some mysterious power. It's said that your dreams come true if you find one. With one of these, my Pokemon can Dynamax. They're gonna be massive. Yes, I love massive Pokemon. That was very convenient. Trust you to pull something like this? They say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever! There, I said it three times, so surely my wish will come true now, right? Uh, don't be silly, Hop. Those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have in here in the Gala region. But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me now and I'll have you sorted. Alright. You've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Professor? Then please, give Laquisha and me the power to Dynamax our Pokémon. First we got to battle against that mad Pokémon in the slumbering wield, and now this. It really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement, young man, 
I don't know why I'm talking like Kermit the Frog, but a little louder now. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, but don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. Well, that's just great. Oh my god, where'd she come from? Seems I came back home right in time for all the excitement. I'm being sarcastic again. Hey, you lot. Why have you? Why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest trendy curries. Nice, curry. That's a good uh, English dish right there. I mean, Indian dish, but... Heavily used in England, I think. There's a lot of Indian cuisine in England. It's very good. There's Indian cuisine here, and it's also very good. Vancouver's got a lot of good Indian cuisine. Very nice. It's morning at last, and time for our adventure to truly start. Good morning to you young challengers. Hop, is it true you really met some Pokemon you didn't recognize? Is there anything more you can tell me about it? Uh, well, there was a weird heavy fog, and then this even weirder Pokemon appeared. Laquisha tried to fight it off, but then I think we both passed out or something. It's all pretty hazy. Get it? Because there was fog everywhere? It was pretty hazy? A right fount of information you are. Laquisha, hop these off for you. Well, that's just great. What? Oh god, you're taking so long to give it to me. Thank you for putting it on the floor so I could pick it up. You got a Dynamax band from the Professor Magnolia and slipped it on your wrist. A wishing star has been affixed to it. It's, it lets out a light that allows a Pokemon to Dynamax when at a power spot. Nice. What's a power spot? Oh, is it? Oh. Uh, maybe it's specific spots you can only do Dynamax at. Those are your Dynamax bands. <laughs> God. Oh, why do I suck at voice acting? Jesus. I made them by fitting the wishing stars you found last night to those bands. This isn't the same accent I was giving before. Thanks, Professor. This is brilliant. It's just like the one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax our Pokemon like he does. My word, you don't waste time, do you? That's not the accent. Holy crap, why can't I get the accent back? It was like... He's like talking like this, but it's like, oh my word, there we go, I can do it again. My word, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find it's not so simple as all that. The number of conditions you must meet if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax and take on that gigantic form. Now don't be afraid to go to all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon. That will help you fill out your Pokedex too. The legend of my reign is finally about to begin. Come on, Laquisha. I'll beat you to the station. He really wants to beat me in races because he knows he can't beat me in a Pokemon battle. It's hilarious. A strange Pokemon in the slumbering wield. I don't know. I've got an uneasy feeling for some reason. Maybe because it's strange and it's a Pokemon. Hey, Laquisha. What? Wait, why do I press Y? I pressed Y. <gasps> Wycom! Wycom offers may connect you to Pokemon and other players and other stuff happening. I should actually read this because I don't know what this is. Uh, there's never a shortage of things to do. When stamps arrive in Wycom, while you're out on your adventure, it means that other trainers are around and looking for someone to connect with. Press the Y button to see who's around. Normally you can use the Wycom to connect with people close by, but if you press the plus button, or the... Actually, yeah, the plus button, and connect to the internet, you'll be able to connect with people around the world. Select a stamp that shows the silhouette of a Pokemon on it, and you'll be able to team up with your fellow trainers to battle Pokemon. Oh, that's great! Surprise trade! Oh, surprise trade is, is um, the global thing. Global network wonder trade. Yeah. Wonder trade. Link battle? Link trade? Okay. Guys, so now that I know the, the ability is in this game, I knew it was going to be anyways. The finale of both in me and Brent's series is going to be a Pokemon battle between the two of us. Best two out of three if we can do it. And uh, yeah, that'll be the finale to his series and my series. So definitely, you know, it's coming, guys. I'm hoping to beat this game. I don't know how long this game is, but I, uh, I really want to keep playing this game. But you know what? My voice is kind of dying right now. So I think I'm going to have to save it. And I'll continue this next time on the next episode of, uh, I don't know, this game. Uh, be excited, there's gonna be a lot of stuff happening. Oh, Versus? What? You can just press Versus? Victory Station? 
Oh gosh. Oh, live competition battle stadium? Oh god. You battle people you've walked by. That's crazy. Alright, all right, boys and girls. I'll join you on another Pokemon adventure. Or... The same Pokemon adventure, but later down the line when I record again. So have a great day, everyone. And, uh... I don't know, have a great night, evening, whenever you're watching this. And, uh, enjoy life. And enjoy Pokemon. Because Pokemon makes the world go round. Probably, maybe? I think? I have nothing else to say.